Now to a developing story involving a tuberculosis scare in Grand Prairie ISD. Health officials are preparing to test dozens of students after learning one may have been exposed to the infection. CBS 11's Elizabeth Din is live near South Grand Prairie High with what we need to know. Good morning, Adrian. A young man who is a senior here at SGP High School is sick with what could be a case of tuberculosis. The results of his test that would confirm whether he has TB won't be in for another six to eight weeks. But just in case, school leaders sounded the alarm for students and parents. It was on Monday when Dallas County health officials called Grand Prairie ISD, alerting them about the sick student who had a questionable health screening. Then all 2,400 students here plus staff members got a letter about the fact that they may have been exposed to someone who has TB. Out of that big group, roughly 150 to 180 people who were potentially in contact with the student were told they will be tested right here at the school by the Dallas County Health Department next week. Again, there isn't confirmation yet whether the young man has TB. This is really is precautionary, and that's kind of the way that, that Dallas County approaches these things. It's better to get out in front of it and, and do the testing and check to make sure instead of having it down the line when you do have a confirmed case and then it's a little bit more serious. Tuberculosis is a bacterial disease that usually attacks a person's lungs but can affect other parts of the body too. It can spread when someone with TB in their lungs or throat coughs or sneezes and spreads those germs. Symptoms include feeling weak, weight loss, fever, and night sweats. As something to keep in mind though, TB is most threatening to people who have already a weakened immune system or came down with TB within the last couple years. Reporting live in Grand Prairie, Elizabeth Din, CBS 11 News.